Welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel and today in continuing our series that we've started with decoding digital mode signals one of the things that is very useful is to be able to identify what type of signal you're actually listening to and there's a fantastic page that is the signal identification guide um, which is a wiki page and it has of course different categories of signals so you can actually check out the different types of signals here um, some of the easiest to often be able to identify are amateur radio so you can check out amateur radio there's the utility uh, and um, of course you can check out the different types of signals that are available here to learn more about what types of signals you are listening to but there's a lot of help in these pages so when you choose a mode or choose a category what's going to happen is you'll have the different types of signals you have a waterfall image which is nice because that waterfall image will show you what it looks like if you're using an SDR and that's very very useful because by using the SDR you'll be able to identify and try to you know match the pattern that you see with what you actually have on screen and what you hear and for the rest if you don't have an SDR have a regular radio well you do have the audio samples of every mode so if for example you're hearing uh, some uh, mode let's say that I'm uh, hearing some uh, domino F here um, it's gonna tell you the frequency range where you should hear it in the hand bands and you can press the play button where you'll hear what it sounds like now a lot of them do sound very similar and it's in the very intricate details that you'll sometimes know what it is but when you hear stuff you can actually check out and start acquiring that um, uh, I would say that experience of being able to identify some different modes by their audio so so you have different things like that so it's every amateur mode is in here and of course there's other types of uh, digital signals so even what's cool here is that if you're wondering what some of the sounds on shortwave are all about you can actually check out the different um, identifications. So for example, here in radar, you can listen to it. And this will give you an idea of what all of this could be. Codar. So it gives you an idea of what different uh, signals are available in radars and different types of, you know, weird signals that you might hear, not just the ones that you can actually decode. So this page is really, really useful. I'm sharing it in the description below the video. You'll just have to go into the page and check out the different categories. Amateur radio signals are easy to, um, to uh, find. And by listening regularly and watching some of the waterfall, you'll slowly recognize some of the most common digital modes that are available. So uh, this is a, an amazing page and it's probably your best friend if you're starting out in digital mode decoding. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.